Period one, AP language. Period two and three, AP chemistry. Same. Same. What is half chemistry? Seems so boring. When am I gonna use this ever in my Hi life? There. Ah! Who are you? My name is the AP Chem Fairy, and I'm here to show you how you use chemistry in real life. How'd you get into my house? Who are you? I will tell you. Man of the science guy. Man of the science guy. Science rules. Man of the science guy. Inertia is a property of matter. Jo, 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 Jo. T minus seven seconds. Man of the science guy. It's so hot out here. I mean, it's your fault. Again. Oh my goodness. This one. You wearing that sweatshirt and being hot is an example of chemistry in real life. Your heat is thermodynamics, and as you can see by this diagram, temperature is the measure of average kinetic energy. How is that floating there? <laughs> the girls jumping on the trampoline is an example of entropy, which is the measure of disorder. Their motions are chaotic and unorganized. Now that somebody else has joined the group, there is more entropy in the system because clearly there is more disorder, like in molecules and in chemistry. Six and a half hours later. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. something and it might be hatred towards you. Down rocket for the treasure room. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> now wait one second, I can join. I'm sure we're going to use this in real life. Down rocket. We literally did the old version of that would think it was a star. Making lemonade, making, making lemonade. Guys, lemonade is an acid. Like the drug? No. Like the thing that killed Jay? No. Well, yeah. Lemonade is an acid, which means it has an excess of hydrogen ions, giving it a low pH, close between zero and seven. Sell lemonade, sell them, sell them lemonade. Oh, lemonade, can I have some? Sure. You know it's an acid, right? Like chemistry? Yeah. Why would you do that? That's my lemonade! I have a persona to uphold and it's hating everything that involves chemistry. Water, selling, selling water, selling water. See, water is good because it's not chemistry. Guess oh, who's right? wrong? You guys! Ow. See, water is a very special substance because it's amphiprotic, which means it could be both an acid and a base. Because it has Ow. two ions, an H plus and an OH minus. Ow. The H plus ion is the Help ion for acid, out. as you learned before, and the OH minus ion is the base ion. Fine, I'm never drinking water again. You know you're gonna die in three days if you don't drink any water. So anything. I'll die in three days. Selling, selling bleach, selling bleach. Can I have to go? Aren't you allergic? That's kind of the point. Bleach uh, is chemistry. Why did you hear that? Bleach is chemistry! How is everything chemistry? Yes! How? A bleach is a basic substance, which, as I told you before, it has an excess of OH minus ions. Bleach is a basic substance. Stop sobbing, it's for the better. Okay, can you pass the salt? Salt is chemistry! Salt is a compound 
called NaCl. And in between those two ions, there are in ionic forces where the ions transfer electrons between themselves. And then there are also more forces, obviously, because chemistry is everywhere, like covalent forces, like in this sugar. Where did you bring that with you? No, we took it from your house. But anyway, the ions in this share their electrons. Chemistry! I'm gonna bash my head in with this hammer. That's a phallic bonding. Let's go get a new phone. What's that smell? It's the smell of chemistry and gasoline. See, gasoline is made up of a bunch of organic compounds called alkanes, especially octanes. Alkanes are strings of carbon atoms connected by single bonds with hydrogens attached at the end. For chemistry. I don't see how she can get to us. You're not safe for me if you're breathing, because breathing is chemistry. How on earth is breathing chemistry? Why is everything chemistry? I just don't understand how everything can relate to science. See, the air is composed of many elements, especially carbon dioxide, nitrogen, and oxygen. And you know what those are, right? Oh. Elements, except carbon dioxide is a compound, but it's made of elements. The elements can be all be found on the periodic table composed by Dmitry Mendeleev in the 1800s. And elements are everywhere. In the air, in your body, in the grass, in this bench. Are you holding your breath? Mm-hmm. You can't survive by that breathing. Hope my bread rises. I wonder how it rises. Yeah. Wait, that's probably Kim. Oh my god, don't be stop! Oh, yeah. oh, oh my god. Chemistry! Oh my god. See, when you bake stuff, you add a bunch of ingredients together, causing a chemical reaction, especially in yeast. And one of the byproducts of that chemical reaction is CO2. Does anybody know what CO2 is? It's a chem thing. thing. Yeah, it's a chem thing. It's a gas, especially. So it creates little pockets in the bread, causing it to rise. I don't care. That happens everywhere, though. You have to care. Why did I mention it before? Donut bread, like you see it in a lot of foods. Chemistry. Ow, my eye. And it's the ion. An ionic compound. Are you kidding me? No. <laughs> no. Now do you guys see how chemistry is? Everywhere, My I see eye. how I see how I hate everything now. Yay! So if you ever need me again, just recite Avogadro's number: six point oh two times ten to the twenty-third. Wait, how did you get it to my house before? I left the door unlocked. So no one told you that was gonna be this way. Your job's a joke. You broke. Your love lives to your way. They were doing our chem project. To see if you can fly? No. Yeah. <laughs> the answer is no. Can you fly, David? I can't, but he may be able to. Joy, you guys just dropped EP Chemistry in the beginning of the year. Do you have any reason why you let, you dropped? Because I didn't want to take it. Why? Uh, I don't know. Well, now you're being featured in the video. How do you feel about that? I really don't care. All right. How do you feel Tell him Skelly. Yeah. What? How do you feel about EP Chemistry? It was a waste of my time being in there. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you. How do you feel? You dropped EP Chem after the first two tests, and you're going to be on the video project now. I feel free. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, our fellow chemistry classmates. How do you guys feel? How do you about guys feel about thermodynamics? I love it. Mr. Steves really said so. it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> right, Mr. Steves. Mr. Steves. Mr. Steves, I have a question for you. As the EP Chem Fairy, how do you feel about thermodynamics? Oh, what's going on? I think thermodynamics is hot. It's what? You're just scaring me right now. What is I it? I said thermodynamics is hot. It's hot? Yes. Thank you. All right, thank, thank you. That's all we needed. <laughs> say hi to AP Chemistry. Hey, Sam, Sam, say hi to AP Chem.